Hey YouTube, it's Cooper. Um, let's uh, show you some of the, my recent finds at the garage sales. Start off with this uh, skimmer board. Uh, solid wood, has some wax build up, I gotta strip that off. But uh, I got two of these. And uh, they were a dollar a piece. I don't know, we don't have much waves here in Las Vegas, but uh, uh, they should I should easily get twenty a piece, thirty a piece. I don't I don't really know. Put them on Craigslist. If not, they they make uh, great wall art. Nice piece of wood. Anyway, let me get this out of the way. And uh, about a few other things. Not much. Finding much for resale. I was found this today. Uh, it's a Presto Pizzazz pizza oven, and uh, it has the pan. The pan just goes on like that. Spins around, it heats up. I tell you, look on uh, YouTube. There's a lot of videos. It cooks more than pizza. Chicken wings. Some guy baked cookies on it. Hot dogs, hamburgers. Chicken wings. Oh, I think I said that already. <laughs> anyway, all, just about anything uh, you want to heat up, really. Uh, it was five dollars. I saw uh, reason I bought. I saw on Amazon even used these to sell for like thirty-eight dollars. But I am definitely going to try it out, and I may end up keeping this because if it's really that great, uh, I'll just keep it. Uh, and then I got this. Uh, coffee cup. It's, uh, it's with the uh, medical uh, profession symbol on there in the US, but it's a nice clean cup. It's 50 cents. It's uh, Shenango, China. Oh. It's definitely worth 50 cents. Then I got this um, El Producto Queens. Uh, this is counter display for cigars. However, there's no cigars. It's missing uh, a couple of the glass tubes. But it's full of uh, Irwin Tools drill bits. And for two dollars, you know, probably some of these bits might go for two dollars themselves. Anyway, uh, nice tools in it. I think uh, this counter display would also sell for. Uh, Something, although I haven't, I haven't looked it up. It's just too good to pass up. Then I got this uh, intervideo, intervideo, excuse me, DVD copy five platinum. Uh, they're up to number seven now. It apparently, makes uh, great uh, copies of your DVDs. It's only dollar fifty. And I also got this uh, same place, Radio Shack. Amplified HD TV antenna, and that was also a dollar fifty. Uh, these don't sell used for as much as I thought, but uh, still sells for like twelve dollars on eBay. Make a little profit there. Then I got some books. Oh, have it upside down. Uh, the teammates uh, by David Halberstam. Uh, it's about uh, it's a story of uh, Johnny Pesky, Dom DiMaggio, uh, Bobby Dor, and uh, Ted Williams. When Ted Williams was dying, they all got together and went to visit Ted. Should be an interesting story. I like uh, David Haverstam's books anyway. Uh, plumbing one two three book from the Home Depot. Uh, this book is from 1961. It says Book J EDL Word Clues. So some sort of a teaching guide or test or something. I don't really know. But I thought it would be worth something, but it's really... Uh, I can't find anything on that one. I thought this, the, the art interior design, might be worth something. Anyway, I paid 25 cents for all these books. 25 cents a piece. Uh, one of bedrooms. Another uh, decorating book. 
then uh, a double day book of interior decorating this is from the 60s so I said oh that's cool that might be worth something and this uh, how to make your windows beautiful uh, this is a, a Kirsch publication and this is the only one worth anything all the others worth uh, maybe a penny but this has uh, it's all from the 60s is uh, copyright 1961 on it just full of uh, cool 19 early 1960s photos and actually that one will sell on Amazon for nine dollars so all in all not a waste then I got uh, a bunch of DVDs for a penny a piece excuse me one dollar piece the wedding planner Grease, Friday Night Lights, The Fog, Timeline, Jersey Girl, uh, Walk the Line, waiting to see that one, Dragonfly, The Stepford Wives, Die Another Day, uh, World Series 2001 with the Yankees and the Diamondbacks, and the last one is Charlie's Angels. I mean, like I said, dollar a piece. I'll watch them, then I'll swap them on uh, swap a DVD. And I got a few cassettes, five cassettes, and uh, this case logic case. There's fifty cents for the whole thing. Uh, this this uh, barbecue lighter, which reminds me that uh, about a Weber kettle barbecue, the full size. I think 22 and a half inch. Found one today for ten dollars, and I've been looking for one, so I was happy to find that. And I got a little, few Halloween things, uh, these little candle things, and an electronic. Uh, it's Snoopy, but it's, it's like a pumpkin. But it's got uh, it's electric. It's got a light in the back. He lights up. Uh, I got all these things for uh, like uh, fifty cents, sixty cents. Everything was half price at this lady's sale, so I bought it, quite a lot of stuff. And then I got this, uh, oh, I gotta lift it up. It's a uh, Tri Light Cot by Buyer. Uh, these, apparently, very good cots uh, for camping. It's an aluminum frame, it just folds up and folds in that little bag there. About maybe 30 inches long, maybe uh, eight inches wide. There, not all that uh, big, but uh, it was ten dollars used. These still sell for like uh, fifty, sixty dollars. I may just keep that. Go camping. I like backpacking, camping, which uh, reminds me, I got a couple uh, uh, 1970s backpacks, and uh, this one's a. Uh, Nuco brand and I can't find a brand on this one but anyway uh, I thought one was marked ten dollars and one of them five dollars and so I asked the gentleman if he'd take ten dollars for the both and he thought and thought and thought and thought and finally he says that's like giving one away he says uh, one's fifteen and one's ten I said oh I misread it and I go back along and sure enough uh, the one was barely visible, but uh, it was marked 15. He says, uh, give me 15 for the both. And I said, yeah, I'll give you 15 for the both. Anyway, like I said, I like backpacking. Uh, those are come in handy. Well, basically, that's about all I got. Uh, like I said, not a much for resale. But still, I make... Uh, oh, I got this box of uh, Disney toys. I don't know if anything's really worth anything in there. Uh, paid twenty dollars for the box, and I probably over. I'm sure I overpaid. Uh, the toys that are dated are dated 1984, made in various countries. But uh, I don't know. They may bring something, maybe not. Maybe I'll just donate them. Anyway, thanks for watching my video. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you had a good week picking yourself. And, uh, yeah, there's Piglet there. And good luck. Thanks for watching. Bye.